that we are playing will continue to be played on our airways and on TV. But all the places that we have visited, Surprise has actually written to all their suppliers that without the tax stamps, they will not pick their goods. And that they should even come for their products, they should come and stamp products on their shelves. And we have corrected that position that Surprise, as a retail shop, has the right to apply for the stamps to be put on the products. And they have a student, and they are taking an inventory, and very soon we will receive an application to that effect. All of them have heard the message. Just that they thought we were joking. We are not joking. Full enforcement is starting today. And the next time we come and we still find the products without the stamps, it will be a different story. Almost all the manufacturing firms, for the big manufacturing firms, all of them have registered. And most of them also undertake import. They also import products. And as I speak to you, most of them companies like GGBL, that is Guinness, ABL, Distel, all of them have been granted authorization to affix stamps on their imported, imported products at their own warehouse. And they are doing so. So all the value products imported by, say, Guinness, like the black label, the red label, all of them that will be coming to the next shop, you will see the stamps affixed to them. You know, so we have done enough sensitization and we have been engaging them. Remember, the law governing this activity was passed in 2013. And we have engaged importers and manufacturers since 2014. So nobody can claim not to know anything about it. Just that people thought we were joking. And now we have shown to every Ghanaian that we mean business. That enforcement fully has started today. Yeah.